Hi there. Welcome to today's big question. What makes things move? Look at this picture. What are they doing? The woman is pulling the girl, and the girl is moving. Now look at this picture. What is happening? The girl is pushing the box, and the box is moving. Push and pull are both forces. A force makes something move. Look at this chair. A push moves it away from me. A pull moves it towards me. Can you name something you push and you pull? These people are shopping. They're all pushing shopping carts. Look at this farmer with his horses. What are the horses doing? They're pulling this plow. Look at these people. They're rowing. Are they pushing or pulling? They are pulling. We often use push and pull movements in sports. A small force causes a small movement. Look. And a big force causes a big movement. Oops. Speed is how fast things move, but some things move faster than others. Cars move faster than people, and planes move faster than cars. A force can change the speed of things. A big force moves things quickly, and a small force. Moves things slowly. It's easier to move a light thing than a heavy thing. Look at this chair. There's something heavy on it, so it's difficult to push. <sighs> Now it's lighter, so it's easier to push, and it moves faster. Watch. Oops! Not again. And sometimes, two opposite forces can mean that no movement happens. We see things move every day. We see people walking, animals running, and trees blowing in the wind. Look around your classroom. What things are moving?